Take a look at these picturesque paintings. These were done this week on Tillman Island as part of the Plein Air Easton Competition and Arts Festival. The nine day event is the largest outdoor painting competition in the entire nation. And currently it's going on in Talbot County. And one of the big focuses is in its 19th year is mental health. So our friends at For All Seasons are playing a pivotal role. Delmarva Life's Katie Cirilli takes us to Easton to learn more. The largest outdoor painting competition in the country is back. And new this year, Plein Air Easton is making mental health a priority. If you think about it, it is kind of wild. We're taking people um, away from all their support structure, away from home. We're, we're, we're putting them to live with host families who, you know, they may not have met or connected with before. And then on top of that, um, we're putting them in an intense com competition. Now in its 19th year, Plein Air Easton brings artists from across the globe to Talbot County for a competition in creativity. The French term plein air means open air. So the subject for this art, the entire area. They're painting what they see. They're painting the landscape. They're painting the community. They're painting the beaches and the boats and the um, agricultural fields that everybody has grown to love in Talbot County. Yes, it's as idyllic as it sounds, but it can also be intense. It's high pressure and high heat, which could most certainly lead to high stress. And the team behind this event recognizes that. What happens when you're in an intense um, competitive environment? What kind of supports do you need? I think really just even showing empathy and admitting how hard it is is something that we've never necessarily taken a moment to do. So this year, they're doing it, according to Jessica Bellis, who's chief operating and finance officer of the Avalon Foundation. That's who puts this event on. When they approached For All Seasons Behavioral Health and Rape Crisis Center about bringing their mental health message to this event, it was a no-brainer. When we come up upon uh, an artist who's painting with plein air, you think, oh my gosh, that's, so, that, that's such a beautiful painting. We think, oh my gosh, what talent they bring. But we don't stop and think about the stress that this festival could have everything riding on it. You know, it's like the Olympics of plein air happening here in our community. And so we, what we want people to understand is that when artists come to plein air, the community has an ability to say, we see you. We see you for the stress that you're gonna be going through. We see you that it's a really hot couple weeks. We see that you need to be taken care of and you need to be appreciated for the whole you that you bring to the festival and not just the artistry and the talent that is provided through you. For All Seasons is saying this in a number of different ways, according to CEO Beth Ann Dorman. She helps kick the event off with a presentation. They're handing out fans with mental health messages, offering art therapy, and more. Really just being able to say, in this community, mental health matters. In this community, you're more than an artist. You are a part of us now because you've come to be a part of this festival. And no matter where you turn, For All Seasons and the Avalon Foundation see you as the whole person. And at an event bringing thousands together from all over, what an opportunity to have conversations and reduce stigma. I think that there is nobody who cannot um, say that they haven't been touched by um, mental health in the last couple of years, especially. And that's why, as we navigate the current mental health crisis, For All Seasons continues to be a leader in community mental health. They're unrelenting in their efforts to make themselves known as a big time local resource. Plein Air is a perfect example of recognizing that mental health services are not always about the community coming to us, but us going to the community and saying, hey, we have something that's important, pay attention, and having people come back and say, oh yeah, that's happening in my household too. So while the beauty of the brush strokes may only last through the weekend, the hope is that these deeper lessons will be lifelong. And if you're interested in mental health services for all seasons, it is taking on new clients, but then says there's no wait list and they have walk-in appointments available. I want to say they do a lot of work with first responders. Yes, they do. They are fantastic. Mm -hmm.